Hello and welcome to a new video about IT systems. This time we are talking about a barcode, yet another barcode all of you probably know. We are talking about the European article number, which is pretty similar to the universal product code in the US. In fact, both are now combined also in the global, global trade item number. Uh, working all the same way. Here is one example. Uh, so, this is a so called EN code. Uh, right, EN code. Uh, European article number. You see, you see EN codes are separated. Yeah? They're there is a start sign and a stop sign. They are both looking the same. It's three bits broad. Yeah? It's always a thin line, a thin gap and a thin line. Yeah? And in the end I have a thin line, a thin gap and a thin line. Start and stop sign. Okay, they are always the same. And in the middle I have a thin gap, I have a, I have a thin line. I have a thin gap, I have a thin line, and then I have a thin gap. So here we have two, three bit start, yeah? here we have three bit stop, and here in the middle we have five bit gap, stripe, gap, stripe, gap, yeah? as middle marker. Okay. So we have a left part here. And we have here a right part. And both of those two parts contain numbers. So both of them contain six numbers. And each number is coded six digits, digits, better word, also here six digits. Each digit is coded with seven bits. So there is a pattern of seven, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven parts. Some of them are black. Huh? Some of them are white. I'm not exactly sure if this is really a pattern. However, this should be just an example. Yeah? Uh, following rules are applied. Yeah? Maximum four, four are, in say, uh, are the same. In sequence. So at a maximum four blacks or four white ones. Huh? There is nothing more than four black and four white ones. Huh? And they all consist of two lines and two gaps. Huh? Like here. There are two lines, two gaps. And each of these lines is maximum four, minimum one, of course. And minimum gap is one, and maximum gap is four. Okay. These are the rules. So, this, you see that there is the pattern with different, different width of the, of the gaps and of the, of the lines. And out of this, each combination uh, of this, this is given uh, the, the, the letter. So far, so good. Uh, okay, there is a pattern, black and white pattern, gives a letter. However, there are different codings on the left side and on the right side. Now it's getting critical. Uh, we have the letter zero 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, these are the possible digits. Yeah. On the left side, they might be coded odd or even. Yeah. On the right side, they only coded even. What does this mean? Yeah. So here is the, is the line. Even means number of black bits is even. So this would be even. One, two, three, four black bits is a even. Okay. Odd means number of black bits. Is odd. Okay. And each of these consists of, of seven bits. Yeah. So on the right hand side, yeah, there's there are only even combinations, only with, with four bits. Yeah? The even combination on the right hand side for, for zero. Now I have to look up in the table, is 1, 1, 1, these are the black ones, 0, 0, 1, 0, huh? 1, 1, 1, 3 black, 2 white, 1 black, 1 white. This would be on the right hand side. Yeah? The uneven or the, the odd part on the left side is mirroring this. Yeah? So here we would have 0, 0. 0, 1, 1, 0, 1. This is a mirror of the even part of the left hand side. Yeah? And here, the, the even part, <laughs> the, the even part, so this is an inversion, let's call it, inversion, yeah? the odd of the, of the even part of the right side, the left odd is inverted, all bits are inverted, and mirrored, yeah? Is the even part on the left side. So it is 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1. Okay? So it's like here you can imagine there's a mirror, and if I mirror this, it looks like this. Yeah? In the FE, if I invert this, it looks like this. Yeah? These are different codings so on the left hand side. We code a zero either in this combination, with this bit combination, or with this combination. Here it's odd coded, here it's even coded. On the right hand side, there are only even codes, and a zero would look like this. Huh? Let's see if I find this. So this is an even code, one zero, so this would be one zero zero one 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 zero. Let's see if I can find it in the code table? Yes, yes, this would be a 5, a right 5, right hand 5, yeah? so 5. Here we would have 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0. Yeah? Inverted, yeah? 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. Yeah? This would be the odd on the left hand side. Or mirror it, yeah? 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, mirrored. This would be the even on the left hand side. Yeah? So this is a right 5. And there are different combinations simply. Yeah? Following these rules, maximum 5 are the same in sequence, so maximum 4 gaps or 4 lines, 4 ones or zeros, and uh, 2 lines and 2 gaps. There are different combinations then. Why is that so complicated, right? I mean, there are <laughs> there are different codes for the same letter depending on the position, and even if they have the same 
area, the left hand area, there are two codes. This is because I have then one digit, which is at the beginning, and this has no stripes and nothing. Here, at this left hand side, there is then a combination of odd, even, even, odd, odd, even, even, of, fall, of a sequence. Huh? How, in, in which combination those things are, are, the first one is odd, the next one is coded in even, the next one is coded in even, regardless of the numbers. Huh? And because of this combination on the left hand side, of the combination of odd and even, there is even coded a 13th digit. Yeah? So I can one digit coded by odd even sequence. Yeah? Six digits coded by left codes and then six digits coded by right codes. And that's it. Huh? See? Easy, right? <laughs> All and those things, yeah, this coding and so on, this makes this easy to read or it's of course it's not easy. Yeah? In the next video we're going to do an example where we're going to do it exactly with this. Uh, with this code. We try to decode it ourselves, that, that you understand better how this code is working. I will also place this code table and so on as download link under this video, also with the example and so on, so it should help you to understand how this EN code is working. Uh, the reason for these things here yeah, is that we can read it either way and know exactly, aha, uh -huh, Read it from the left, read it from the right, it's readable from every angle and so on. This is the big benefit I can reach if I code it with different stuff. Code it that way. And this made it that successful, this code. So as I like said, next time we're going to make an example. And after this we're going to talk about 2D codes, not only barcodes, 2D codes. Huh? For this time, thank you very much for listening and goodbye.